दर किसी का आज दर किसी का आज दर किसी का आज एक दिन ओहो मन में है विश्वास पूरा है विश्वास we shall overcome one day to come out for days being in this uh, beautiful setup and uh, every little thing in this training was so beautifully planned and done uh, living in this experience is a bliss um, i didn't feel i was in a training actually it was more like a home um, the setup was uh, very light so even though i had to work on myself uh, to all the areas which i you know i wanted to uh and i get out of the session it was more relaxing and uh, giving me uh, uh, much peace for my body and mind because we were doing yoga and uh, uh, we were playing with the kids being with the uh, nature that was actually stress relieving as well as uh, giving me a, a break and then coming back to the session both the experience of you know relaxing as well as working on myself it was a bit different workshop because uh, it didn't have slides it didn't have projector it didn't have a lot of notes and or reference guides or a lot of videos but i think it put us into a setting where we daily function so we daily function without slides without projector without xyz and uh, our daily interaction so it literally brought us to very basic and you know fundamentally correct ourselves or see what are the areas of improvements also i really love the way sir was able to observe uh, small little minute things which were present in us but we only were maybe missing it or getting clouded also it gave me a good opportunity how the others are also perceiving and a lot of good company from a very neutral point of view with a very helpful focus uh, of giving feedbacks etc really help me so i would say i would really like to come again it's like a home away from home that's how i look at it neuro linguistic programming if that stands for nlp it gave a perspective of normally linked patterns of an individual in this uh, session so reading between the lines was uh, very well illustrated during this uh, session where it was more of uh, picking up threads from the general casual discussions that happened and trying to identify those patterns and see what can be uh, the right way of putting it across what are those patterns is it good or something that's be uh, studied and uh, that can make you a little better in terms of what you're doing speaking about the patterns and breaking patterns what is something uh, a real take away from the session what i really a lot of patterns so strong uh, at a very subconscious level deeper level after this uh, session it's like a lot of sessions outside will give it as that awareness but they created a space in such a way that we work consciously in breaking the pattern and then activity especially the the drawing part of is something which uh, which is a revelation for me like how much uh, little speaking in my perspective bring in so much change in the way that i think and this is where it stands out and speaking about mr ashok and his uh, the sessions uh, as she said it was so effortless it was so like uh, you we are not into a session where like we don't even feel like last four days was uh, a intensive session but it was without anesthesia he went so deep inside our heart mm -hmm. mind soul so and did an operate mm -hmm. operate and take out a lot of things and present it beautifully in such a way that like we work on ourselves like it's it's it, it comes with his experience which we rarely find kind of uh, mastered trainers uh, who can deliver such So also the environment uh, that we are in makes it more uh, conducive for such kind of uh, activities to uh, happen and uh, that we can let go of our uh, things that are in the mind and come back to the heart side of uh, ourselves to understand listen and get going with all I really want to mention about the modeling exercise mm -hmm. so that was something which uh, usually we always see things from our perspective we feel we are right and uh, a lot of times during the workshop also this came up that i was told that you know uh, 
uh, I think I have a story. I believe it so much that I needed the uh, universal truth, and th- it might not be the universal <laughs> truth, or maybe. But we need to give that level of understanding to the other person. Uh, I used to always feel I'm very understanding, but while I was doing that exercise, it made me feel there is a lot of burden the other person is carrying. Uh, we need to really step into their shoes, understand it. and disengage also which was very important we don't have to become that but we can just pick qualities and skills and then see what can be applicable to us that will give us a very positive view towards the other person and give us an understanding of uh, things easier said than done but at least starting to move in that direction in the last session when we were doing in, in bangalore for the introduction of nlp it was a uh you know room set up so we had to come from 9 to 5 and be there so the question was there uh you know how will i be able to carry this uh, whatever i have learned on a day to day basis because uh, they won't they won't be ashok sir for reminding or you know you know showing the perspective or you know just holding the mirror and you know you can see yourself but uh, in this trip it was all you know uh, complimentary whichever was actually uh, i was thinking came into practice and i had a very good uh, uh, understanding about myself how i carry and how i am interacting and uh, actually what what is my thoughts behind my interactions which was very subtly observed myself and if i missed something definitely actually it was uh, said by ashok sir and it was very it was in a very gentle way not actually uh, uh, disturbing or uh, even if i'm allowed to be in my space i think i can look myself uh, i'm able to understand that because it's a uh, not a very regular setup uh, so the residential training i would say it is really uh, eye opener uh, i didn't expect that. i came with a very uh, blank uh, thought that how it's going to be i didn't have anything but definitely the environment added a lot of uh, new dimensions and uh, in a very subtle way especially uh, feel very thankful for ashok's family uh, two person who really worked inside me is ashok and his son uh, he the 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 stress that i carry with myself when i play with him when i be with him the, the smile the, it it just vanishes it's it's so uh, which anywhere that it cannot be happened in any other setup any other program it can cannot have such such a amazing setup and uh, bringing analogy from pepper and ginger and observing them there is so much uh, the pets can do to our life it's a ideal in you know, a model way of living which uh, every day i keep admiring every day every little thing that i keep learning i believe that contributed a lot inside we shall overcome We shall overcome someday. Deep in my heart, I do believe we shall overcome someday.